Morning, Kennedy High School. It is Monday, September 15th. 2013. Start of homecoming week. Very yes. exciting here at yes. Kennedy High School. Some rules for the homecoming day. No hands on the floor when you're dancing. No inappropriate substances. Make sure you have fun and obey the rules. Throughout the years, dancing and music have evolved alongside each other, each one becoming progressively more sexualized. This has led to risque dancing at school functions. There are certainly boundaries at events like this, but how far can these boundaries be pushed before it all just becomes too much? Some older dances that my grandparents or my parents might have done would be like swing dancing or like 60s dancing. The only one that comes to mind is the hustle. I suppose I know how to do the Macarena. My parents and I have danced to like the Charleston or like the two step or something. The waltz or polka dancing. I know my grandparents probably did the jive back in the day. I'd say some of the new dances are that that get me going are like twerking, uh, a little grinding. I don't even know if that's a dance. Mostly grinding and twerking. Grinding, twerking. Uh, the wobble. I know they like to do the wop and the wobble. I know how to do the wobble and the cupid shuffle is not new, but I know how to do that. The whole uh, twerking fiasco that went down. Yeah, twerking, the wop, uh, jerking, duggy. Uh, I can duggy and I know what twerking is, but no, I will not do it. It depends on the dance, but they have um, become more and more suggestive. The dances nowadays are more inappropriate and more sexual. Kids like to pull up their dresses and do disgusting things. It is what is popular, it is what we see on TV, and so um, the dancing that, that we do see at various uh, dances or other types of events um, sometimes crosses what we consider to be lines of decency. Not as like reserved. A lot more crude and don't have as much style. Definitely a lot less difficult. I think they're just making things easier and easier. We know teenagers are pushing the boundaries of appropriateness at school dances. But the question is, why? Why do they feel the need to get more and more promiscuous with their dance partners? I feel like kids dance the way they do today because they're trying to express how they feel. We don't want to like dance the way our parents did. I think society is more suggestive and sexualized as it is. That's the norm and it's it's part of everyday culture. They have brought out onto the dance floor what used to be reserved for the back seat of cars. And we just want to kind of bring something new to the table. Young people today think that it's cool. Every kid wants to in some way be different. Teenagers will always be doing something that don't, adults don't approve of anywhere. So it doesn't much matter if we're at a dance or we're at the mall. Um, you know, it's it's you know, adults are almost always going to come up with reasons to be upset with teenagers. Uh, most of the dances that I saw at homecoming weren't too bad, but some of the grinding was kind of gross. I just saw a lot of grinding, it was kind of awkward. Yeah, personally, when I went to the dance, definitely got down in a very clean and appropriate way. We got the clapping in, uh, we got the, like, you know, shoulder shimmies, we got, it was, yeah, it was good. And then I will also say that there is times when I, Got a, little got a little low, you know? Did a little grinding. Well, at Harding, all it is is standing around and talking and a few kids jumping around. At Kennedy, is a lot more... It's just all grinding pretty much the whole night. I thought this year's homecoming was way better than the past previous two to three years. The difference between last year and this year was tremendous. You guys did a much better job this year. I felt that the dancing at homecoming uh, this past year um, was, was pretty good. I think the students did a nice job of being respectful toward uh, the standards that we set while uh, you know, enjoying themselves and having a good time. I think the rules for homecoming at Kennedy are reasonable because they're not too restricting but they're not also allowing really gross things to happen. I mean, you have to have rules with high school kids because if not, they'll just do whatever they want. I think the rules are fine, just nobody listens to them. They're not really enforced. I believe most people um, follow the rules because most of everybody was probably pretty scared from like last year about getting kicked out immediately. It could probably be a little less, less strict. We know why teenager dancing has become more risque, but now we have to ask, should we do something about it? I think the rules that are there are fine, it's just everybody following them. I mean, if they got more strict, I don't know how much 
how many people would come. And if we can't go to homecoming because of that, they'll just go to someone's house and get wasted. You can, you can tell a kid to not put their hands on the ground, but if they're feeling it in that moment, they're just going to put their hands down and it's just going to go downhill from there. There are certain things that are not school appropriate and not don't need to happen during the school day or at school events. At a school function, we have to uphold certain standards of decency. I think in the future, a no grinding policy um, would be hard to enforce. It will be harder to find chaperones <laughs> to chaperone the dance um, if people know that they have to enforce the no grinding policy. It's going to come down to what we do on the dance floor at any given dance to determine what the policy is going to be. Um, some dances that parents might think were more appropriate would be like the wobble or the cha-cha slide. Wop, the Harlem Shake. It seems like kids get along fine just running and jumping and you know, doing things in rhythm and time and, and, and enjoying themselves. Like if the DJ were to play like the WAP or the Wobble or like other music like that where it gets the whole crowd going and like they know what they're supposed to be doing, like actual hand movements and like actual body movements that they wouldn't be so susceptible to being like, hey, yeah, I'm grinding on this other person. They would actually have a fun time.